Okay, so Taran is uh, X9D plus with a R9M module. Yeah, I'm putting uh, Express LRS uh, 1.0.0 RC5. Yes, that was the melody for RC5. And uh, let's show you the. Okay, here's the hash and the settings right now. Let's boot up the drone. Okay, the LEDs. RF signal critical. Yeah, RF signal critical. And there uh, we are linked, I think. Uh, let's go back to the main. Yes, it's linked. So again, the menu. And now the values are changing, so it's a point linked. Yeah, you can see it in beta flight. Uh, that control is, yeah, 100%. Perfect rapid movements. No problem, I'll flip a switch or two just to show you. And okay, let's get out of this menu and go to telemetry. Yeah, everything perfectly flashing. At least the first 10 uh, telemetry items, so the, the, those built in, are flashing. The remaining ones um, are not present at all. And uh, in a few minutes, or um, in some time, we should probably lose this link. Uh, <coughs> okay, so. Let's wait. I'll probably speed this up and post. That's 25 milliwatts. Everything works just fine. Lost. And we have telemetry lost. The link is telemetry still there. Recovered. Oh, recovered. That's interesting. Let's see the telemetry screen. Okay. Everything seems in order. No, oh, telemetry is back. Definitely back, but not all of it. You can see the, the sensors that were there previously in uh, 0 0.1.3 RC2 are still missing. I don't think it's related, but anyway, let's wait for another link lost. If it happens. The RC5 is much more stable than uh, RC3 uh, or RC3 patch 1 was. Anyway. <laughs> and there it is. Telemetry lost. Uh, look at the values on better flight screen. They sometimes change, but uh, it's choppy. Oh, there they are. Changing a bit. The link is lost right now and let's try rebooting the drone yeah let's put it back again uh, not connected so the radio is still on and the drone is not connecting and uh, let's look at the uh, telemetry uh, yeah, so it's frozen. No info on the hash. Uh, apparently, I don't think I can change anything or if it will matter. No. Okay, so power cycling. Welcome to Open Sphere. Now let's look at the slide. Physical. 
Yeah, so we have the link back. The blue LED on the FC stopped blinking, so apparently we have uh, inputs again. Let's see what Betterflight says. Yes, the inputs are back. But I had to power cycle um, the transmitter to do this. Okay, now a quick exercise in going back to uh, the previous version. One zero point one point three RC two flashing. Okay. Yeah, the music's changed. Yes, so you can see the version is different. Yeah, we have it back. And let's look at the hash and the script. Yeah, version mismatch. Yes, the version is mismatched anyway. So 2942A6 and it's at least displaying something and the drone is still building the firmware so we have to wait a few more seconds for that. Yeah, uploading and it's yeah, success. So do we have a link? Yes, the labs are back and we can just let's check if telemetry is oh there is nothing about telemetry here. So this is not really, really relevant. Let's see better flight. Yeah. Zero volts. So um it's not connected to a battery, so it's reporting zero volts. Zero volts. And I'll get a battery to show you that it's working as intended with all the telemetry like it was good. Okay, battery is connected. Still zero volts. Oh. Let's see. Oh, that's interesting. Let's unplug the battery Zero again. Lost. Okay. So, uh, the USB connection was messing around with uh, some readings. So it now works, and uh, let's go to the telemetry screen, and this is it, yeah, and you can see all the RX bat uh, values are there, and it's reporting correctly, and the link is solid, uh, there are no problems at all, I flew yesterday almost 10 minutes about less than three kilometers and it was all fine so no point in waiting for something to happen because it won't <laughs> yeah everything works okay thanks